Neo is a DIY add-on for home ventilators, which is able to enhance the air quality indoors by filtering small particles like bacteria or viruses. This video is a process documentation and includes additional instructions for recreation and further development. We start by modeling and 3D printing the frame. The frame is a connection of all parts. It was designed to fit on all classic room ventilators with a rotor cage with diameters from 30 cm up to 45 cm. In total, the printing is about 19 hours long. Combine the two parts of the frame by clicking the smaller frame in the groove of the back side of the bigger frame. Put the HEPA 13 filter in. Thread the elastic cord through the holes to fix the frame. Attach the frame in the middle of the ventilator by expanding the elastic cord over the sides of the ventilator cage. Adjust the length with the stopper if necessary. Take measures for the cover. We need the circumference of the ventilator and the length from the frame to the motor. You will need a windproof fabric. We took a fabric for raincoats. The shape of the fabric is rectangular. The long side is the circumference and the short side is the length from the frame to the motor. Before sewing, cut off two corners to have some space for the cord stoppers. In total, you will sew three straight seams. It will take you less than an hour. The cover efficiently leads the airflow through the filter. After some initial difficulties with our first prototype, like air resistance and leaks, we designed a flexible and aerodynamic fabric cover. Start on the front side and push the cord ends through the big hole at the bottom of the frame. Fix the ends with a stopper and pull them to tighten the fabric. While tightening, it should move evenly into the groove of the frame. Finish the back side, pull the cord to tighten the cover. The ventilator sucks in air and blows it through the HEPA 13 filter. It guarantees that 99.95% of small particles will stick in the filter, which include bacteria, viruses, pollen, dust, aerosols and smoke particles. Our particle measure device displays zero particles while holding it in front of NEO. Finally, we tested our prototype in the flow lab of the Department of Building Physics. The test is called Schlieren method which is used to visualize density gradients in transparent media. By making the airflow visible, it helped us to design the frame and the cover. The design, 3D printing files, sewing pattern and material list are in the description below. The project NEO started during the COVID-19 pandemic. You are able to bring it to the future. Clean air for everyone.